everyone, we're back in the craft room and we're going to be doing a jewelry set today. And it's going to be a pendant and two earrings. And I found these cute little, I don't know what they are. They were in the jewelry section. Actually, I found these in the clearance section. And they reminded me of Suns. And I kind of thought we could have a little bit of fun with it. So that's what we're going to do. And we're going to use the jewelry clay like I have before that's made by Envirotex. And you need equal parts of A and B. And I'm going to need enough to cover the pendant and cover the earrings. Then you want to blend it until it is one consistent color. Okay, when it is all blended, I'm going to take this, I found this little square pendant, again at Hobby Lobby. I'm going to take a chunk of the clay and then I'm going to just pat it down. And I want it to kind of mold to the shape of this square. So what I'll end up doing is kind of squishing it over the edges. And then squishing it back to kind of get the best square that I can get. And it won't be perfect, but that's okay. Okay, I have it on here and I think it's good enough. So I'm now going to just take one of these pieces. and place it on here. I'm going to center it as best I can and then I'm going to give it a little squish so that the clay will grab onto the silver piece. And there it is. Now I'm doing the same thing as I did with the bobby pins. I'm clipping it onto the side of this bowl and that way nothing is pressing on, on the metal pieces so that they should stay in place. I'm going to just take the yellow pigment powder, as I've done in all the other videos, and just dust it right onto the earrings. And then do the same thing with the pendant. Enough time has passed, and I'm going to just brush off any excess pigment powder from the pendant and from the earrings. What I'm going to do now is I have some of these Swarovski crystals and I'm going to just glue them right into the middle of each of these to give it kind of a finished look because the way it is right now it kind of just has that hole in the middle and I want to fix that. I want to cover that up. So I'm going to put just a dab of glue under put it in place I hope you like it. I hope you give it a try. And I hope this helps you just look at things differently. Just because something says maybe it's a clasp or a connector. Just look at it differently and look at the shape and think of different ways that you might use it. Because this turned out kind of cute as sort of a flower or a sun. Just for a different look that you wouldn't necessarily expect. So remember to stop by my website at www.craftclutch.com. And if you have any questions on this or any of my other crafts, or if you just want to see what's going on over there, remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. We will see you next time. Thank you again for watching, and happy crafting.